Good morning. Welcome to the Thursday Thought. I got to thinking about what happened over this past Sunday when my sermon mentioned the, uh, the word um, perception. perception. And when we perceive something, it's something that we have experienced. It's a, in, in this particular case, it's an intellectual thing. You know, what do I perceive? It's, it's like the, the fly versus the spider. You can tell, you can perceive which one is one, but look at the spider. Are you perceiving, or can you tell, is it a good one or a bad one? Based on intellect, you can answer that question. Well, going back to the scripture that we talked about last week, we had Luke chapter 10, and we talked about the Mary and Martha. And the perception of the reader can be misconstrued if they don't understand or pay attention to all the mechanics that goes into that. And this is true of a lot of scripture. And that's why I bring it up. Perception is very important. And your perception will be better if you do the groundwork to understand the context of which the scripture piece is written. So perception is very, very important. Okay? Think about that as you read your Bible, at hopefully daily, and whenever you do, perceive, try to put it into Christ's eyes. What does Jesus see? And what does Jesus understand that we don't? Think about that one. Let's pray. Gracious and loving God, as we try to perceive all things that you teach us, we ask for help. We want to do all things that glorify you. And in that glorification, we need to perceive all things that are important and valid. We ask this, Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen. You have a wonderful, blessed week.